Well, hello my friends and welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing a plan with me and we are working on April 17 through April 23rd. As always, let's take a look back at last week. Um, so yeah, this was my week last week. Um, oh, I totally forgot to put in, um, I went to lunch with my friend Jody from Life's Organized Chaos on Tuesday. I did not put that in, but I'm telling you about it, so it counts, right? Anyway, um, and I also went to lunch with Jody again on Thursday, which I also forgot to put in. I need to just write it in. Hold on, let me just write this in. Okay, I think we're back now. I put them in. If you guys follow me on social media, you know something kind of crazy and big happened this past week. Um, I went to see a house on Monday and I put in an offer on Monday night. I have a well shit sticker on here because I did not win the bid, unfortunately. There was a multi-offer situation and my realtor told me I missed out on it by a couple hundred bucks, which kind of sucks. However, there is a silver lining to this. I actually did another house hunt on Thursday and also put in an offer with him and I'm gonna find out on Wednesday uh, more details and I'll kind of get into that a little bit more as I'm planning and I'll just kind of talk about it a little bit more. Also, I've had like a slammed weekend so far. Um, I was super busy yesterday. I actually went to lunch with Isabel. Um, if you guys know who Jackson is, Jackson is my nephew and Jackson's mom's name is Heidi and Heidi's oldest daughter's name is Isabel and that's who I went to lunch with. We had a great time. I went to do some little shopping afterwards and then afterwards I I just hung out with Heidi and Jackson then I went to Target and today is Easter and I actually just got back from my family's Easter brunchy thing and I'm filming again I was filmed a little bit this morning and now I'm doing this one so anyway all right so here's where we're at this week um, I'm deciding to use this washi tape I think I showed this maybe last week can't remember um, this was I think from Target it's the Scotch washer. I always have to look up to make sure that I'm still recording because I'm like super paranoid that I'm just gonna like stop recording and then I go to edit it and it's like, wait, where'd all that footage go? Ugh, here we go. Oh my goodness. Having all the troubles. Haha. -ha. All right, so I thought this would be really fun this week. Um, I also have these, which I like just found out of my arsenal that I've been wanting to use for a while. They're from a sticker shop that no longer exists, but maybe if you search like watercolor or something on Etsy, you might have something similar. I just thought that the colors went really well with these and I've just have never used them. Plus I've got some house stuff to do, so I figured found those and also I wanted to share um, this sticker shop reached out to me it is K sticker co I believe it's a Canadian shop if I remember right but I wanted to show you the stickers I don't know if I'm gonna use yeah you know what I'm probably not gonna use any in this spread but I will be using this for a July spread coming up in a couple of months um, so this was like a little freebie that she sent me and then also these are her July stickers they are a gloss so if you like matte stickers I don't know if she has matte but this is the glossy kind of fun also I'm kind of obsessed with these um, I don't know if it's coming off very well on camera but they're like little birth control pill packs because this is amazing because you can like mark the Monday or Sunday or however your birth control pill pack is um, like when you like restart your birth control pills I thought that was just like really ingenious and it doesn't like really look like anything it's just a bunch of dots so like I don't know if you're weird about it like nobody would ever really know and then I love these too these are like little closets like little wardrobes so if you're like cleaning out your closet or you've got to like put clothes away or something I don't know I just thought these were really cute so um Thank you so much to the shop owner that sent these to me. I will leave um, her Etsy link down below if you guys want to check that out. Uh, but like I said, I'm not gonna use any in these this spread. I just went to my P.O. box for the first time in a long time and I had a lot of stuff in there. So uh, that was one of the things that I wanted to share. And I will be sharing that stuff on um, Instagram as well. Let's get the party started. 7 a.m. to 3 p.m. I'm so not looking forward to work tomorrow, you guys. Like, Friday? was not a good day. Friday was really stressful. It wasn't fun. 
I'm not gonna get into why it wasn't fun, but it just wasn't a good time. So I'm really not looking forward to Monday morning and the probably copious amounts of voicemails that are I have to deal with at 7 a.m. tomorrow. So yeah, send some good vibes my way or something. Alrighty, so whoops, come on. So, wow, I cannot. Hold on, let's do this a little bit better. Oh my gosh. I can't stick the tape down properly. I'm fired as a plan with me YouTube person. Here we go. Wow. Oh, goodness gracious. And I thought this washi would be fun this week because it's just kind of like spring and cheery and I don't know, kind of, kind of fun. All right, so that's that. And Wednesday, you guys, is a big day. So, remember how I just said that I actually went to go see another house on, it was last Thursday. So interesting thing happened while I was actually looking at the house on Monday. Um, I was leaving that house and this guy approached me, um, like in the little like visitor parking area and was like, hey, are you the realtor? You know, he thought I was the realtor for the other space. And I said, no, 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 I'm not the realtor. Um, you know, I might actually put in an offer on that house, but there's multiple offers. I don't know if I'm gonna get it and all this stuff. And he's like, oh, okay, well, I'm interested in selling my house too. And his um, home is the same exact layout as the other person's home. And I'm like, okay. So we talked for a little bit, talked about the area and stuff. And he's like, well, I hope you get it. But if you don't, like, here's my name and number and, you know, let me know. I was like, all right, sounds good. I said, well, I hope I get it, but you know, if I don't, I'll let you know. Didn't end up getting it, called him on Wednesday, and then he's like, well, why don't you come out on Thursday after work and come and take a look at it? So Jody from Life's Organized Chaos actually met me out there on Thursday because she like loves real estate as well. And um, then we went out to dinner and talked about it and talked all things YouTube as well because, you know, when in Rome, right? He and I actually came to a price then and there, which was awesome because I already knew what I had offered the other couple trying to sell their home. So yeah. Yeah, so on Wednesday, um, I've actually done a little bit of research and um, I wanted to get an inspection. So the inspection's happening on Wednesday as well as we have collectively together hired a realtor to just do the transaction for us. So there's no listing fees and all of that stuff. So they charge like 1% of the sale price to do that. Cause essentially we found each other, um, which is great. So anyway, she's going to be coming at five and the inspector is going to be there at two to start the inspection. But then he wants to meet with us at four to kind of go over everything. So Wednesday is going to be kind of a crazy day. So yeah. So the home inspector is going to be there at two. So put that right there here all right so 4 p.m. is the inspector it's gonna go over the report with us and then um, he'll email me a copy and stuff too just so I have it and then um, we're gonna meet with the realtor as well at 5 she's gonna go over like all the fees and all the closing cost fees all the seller fees and buyer fees and like all that stuff just so we know and then um, once we have an agreement signed then we'll be Good to go. Um, so yeah, so that's this. So Wednesday night, you guys. Also, send me the send me the good vibes, y'all. Send me those good vibes. And then, okay, so okay, <laughs> I've got a problem. I don't know where my NASCAR stickers went. I have a whole slew of stickers over there, and I think my goal for tonight, maybe even tomorrow morning not tomorrow morning, sorry, tomorrow evening, is to go through everything. And I know I've been talking about this for a while. I need to go through everything and I need to create a very large honesty pile of things that I don't need in my life. And I need to just get rid of them because I am so disorganized right now. And I know that's kind of crazy coming from me, but it's like, it's stressing me out so bad that I just need to not have it in my life anymore. I don't know. I mean, and there's so many things that I have that I thought I would use that I'm not using. I don't know. It's like this whole long thing, you guys. Let's do Sunday, maybe I should sleep in. How's that, you guys? Ooh, it's Earth Day on Saturday. Just saw it right there, Earth Day. Cool, all right, I'll do this one for laundry day. I like these like 
sheets like this. I mean, a lot of planner places, I mean, I know this place is not in business anymore, but like, I know a lot of these planner places, they um, actually, you know, have these like little samplers. It's kind of like a nice way to get your feet wet if you're new to planning. Dang it, <laughs> I ruined this. If you're new to planning or you're not sure your style and you just want to try out a couple of things. Um, I'm pretty set in my style, if you will, but um, not 100% set because sometimes I do some weird stuff, you guys, um, and you know it because you see it. Um, let's see here. I think I'm gonna go like this. Usually I like to get all of my laundry done in one day. It makes me, makes me feel good. Laundry day, yeah. Feels oh so fantabulous. I think I'm gonna use this like little light bulb because that's really freaking cute. Like on the home stuff. Cause you know, why not? I'm trying to use up like as much as I can in this kit. I don't even know why I pulled these other ones out. I mean, I like them, but I think one kit is sufficient, I guess. I don't know. I feel like I need like my YouTube stuff down below. Let me just pull out a random thing and see if there's any colors that match up. All right, these orange ones match up, so let's do that. Okay, so obviously Monday, you guys are seeing this. Plan with me. And then I'm gonna be showing the house hunt on Wednesday. And then I'm gonna be doing a financial book review on Friday. Um, and then NASCAR. I need to find those darn NASCAR stickers. So I'm not gonna put anything in for that because it's driving me a little bit bananas, y'all. It's driving me bananas. All right, maybe I'm just gonna stick with the orange theme. Oh. I didn't realize this was gonna be an orange theme week, but apparently it is. All right, so I've got these from Lily Henry. I got like a whole slew of these different colors, but um, I'm gonna use these little circles for work. I really like the way that this looks, that it has like a little, you know, you can like bump it up or bump it down or like throw it right in the center. I don't know, I like the way that that looks. Like a little, just like a little circle. I don't know, I like the way they look. At some point I will film this weekend, of course, but I don't know when that's gonna happen, if that's gonna be Saturday or Sunday. So I don't think I'm actually gonna put it in um, just yet because I'll just wait and see where the week takes me because if everything goes well on Wednesday, honestly, I don't know what's gonna be happening with my schedule after that because there is a lot of coordination that I need to do, a lot of meetings, a lot of paperwork and things like that. So I wanna keep my week pretty well open for that possibility because I don't know what's gonna happen, you guys. So anyway, I think this is gonna be it. I know this is a really quick plan with me this week, but wanted to just get this out of the way and show you what I am gonna be doing. So I'm very, very excited about Wednesday. And if you follow my YouTube channel, you will see the house hunt that this house is all about on Wednesday at 9 a.m. Central Standard Time. I haven't edited any of the footage yet, but I did take a little bit of the footage, so you will see some of that. And then if I obviously get the house, there's gonna be tons and tons and tons of house videos going up on my channel, so I do apologize in advance because there is a lot of work that I'm gonna be doing to this particular house, so. Just wanted to give you fair warning. So anyway, I am gonna go for now. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me for a little part of your day. If you are interested in the planner that I use, all of the links are down below, as well as I have some Amazon links for the writing utensils that I use. Um, I exclusively use this. This is the Pilot Ultra Fine Point Permanent Marker um, for all of my marker things. And then if I just wanna go directly on the paper, I will use the Paper Make Papermate Inkjoy gel pen. Um, this one's a 0.7, but I also like the 0.5 as well. But again, like I said, those links are down below as well as like the camera I use and all that kind of stuff too. So going back to the planner, um, the planner that I use is from Erin Condren. There is a link down below. You can use the link to sign up. And if you sign up and it's your first time ordering anything through Erin Condren, you get a $10 off coupon code emailed to you. You'll get a couple emails before then, but um, the $10 off coupon code is awesome. And once you use it and your order ships, I actually 
actually get a $10 off coupon code to use on another purchase too. So even like the little washi terror thing, um, this is from Erin Condren as well. So there's tons of different things you can get on Erin Condren, not just a planner. So you can literally just buy this if you really want to. So that's kind of a cool deal. But anyway, um, I am going to jet for now. Thank you guys so much for watching and hit the red subscribe button if you haven't already. Thumbs up the video if you liked it or actually this way. My mom tells me to do it this way, but it hurts my wrists, but uh, you know. Anyway, so I am gonna go and I will talk to you all in my next video. Bye guys.